What's good? This is Trey with Vertical Jump Prime. In this video, I'm going to give you the top three ways to increase your vertical jump. Alright, so the first thing you need to be doing is increasing your flexibility. That means stretching. Stretching before and after athletic activity. You have two types of stretches. You have dynamic stretching and you have static stretching. Alright, dynamic stretching would be um would be like lunges um squats obviously unweighted so these they may seem like exercises which they are but they can also be looked on as stretching because basically what you're doing is you're warming up your muscles for the actual activity you're going to partake in so if you're a basketball player volleyball player um any sport that has to do with with jumping and, and running you want to do exercises that are similar to what you're going to be doing so squats um, lunges jumping jacks um, um, you know kick-ups karaoke's um, hopping in place whatever it is any any type of exercise that simulates um, what you're going to be doing you know what i'm saying basically so that's what that is static stretching is is the um old school 30 second stretches um and you know you know what that's about and you have different stretches you can do put, put most of your emphasis on stretching your hamstrings and quadriceps um those are the muscles that um you know put in the most work when it comes to uh you know jumping so you need to stretch those muscles get them ready before athletic activity and when you're done you need to cool those muscles down all right weight training and body weight training are trained to be explosive not to bulk up so the idea is not to look like hercules when you're going to weight room the idea is to get explosive be an explosive <clears throat> My bad. Be an explosive basketball player. Be an explosive volleyball player. Be an explosive athlete. Um, you know, straight up. So exercises that will benefit you with increasing your vertical jump include squats, deadlifts, lunges, power cleans, pull-ups, push-ups, one-legged squats, and leg presses, to name a few. So when I say explosive, I mean you need to do these exercises ex exercises explosively but controlled. Alright, so if you're doing a squat, especially if you're doing a weighted squat, I'm not saying you want to go as fast as possible. I'm saying you want to go as fast as you can while staying in control. Alright, you got to stay safe and you got to make sure you're not um, doing any jerky movements or anything that can disrupt your muscles. You obviously want to stay away from injuries. No excuses if you can't get in the gym. Just do body weight exercises, stretching, and plyometric exercises, okay? If you can't get in the gym, do unweighted squats, do uh, lunges, pull-ups, push-ups, one-legged squats, and, um, you know, whatever it is, uh, sit-ups. You know, you just got to do what you can you can't get in the gym do your body weight exercises stretch do your dynamic stretching and your static stretching and plyometric exercises which is number three all right become an explosive machine plyometric exercises are designed to make you explosive build your fast twitch muscle fibers okay train your mind and your body to be disciplined to move and jump explosively you have to train yourself if this doesn't come natural to you if you're not a naturally gifted um, ex um explosive athlete you got to train yourself all right you got to imprint this into your mind you know you got to train you got to do plyometric exercises exercises include jump squats depth jumps maximum height jumps one-legged jumps do these um every other day or if you do them every day just make sure you're listening to your body make sure you're not pushing yourself too hard all right click the link in the description below or go to verticaljumpprime.com to get your free ebook it'll show you how to add instant inches to your vertical jump there's also a workout plan in there that you can start using all right it has body weight um exercises and plyometrics all right i'll let your boy peace